Welcome everybody to the Flow Training 2 Minute Drill. In this video series, we break down the most important studies and concepts so that you can develop your skills better and faster. Let's go. Think of the last time you were in the zone. You were feeling it. Maybe you were playing basketball and couldn't miss a shot. Or maybe you were making a sale and all the right words just came out naturally. Or maybe you were giving a presentation in class and you just captivated the audience. Regardless of what you were doing, you were performing at a peak level. That is something that scientists call flow. And it's the reason we call ourselves flow training. In this two minute drill, we're going to dive into the definition of flow, then share the three core skills that you can use to help you get in the flow. Simply put, flow is when we are feeling our best and performing our best. But flow is only possible when we stretch our skills just enough to match the challenge. If the challenge is too small, we get bored. If the challenge is too high, we get overwhelmed. Our job is to constantly seek challenges one step beyond their current skill level. I call these one step challenges. But here's the interesting thing. How often do we avoid challenges in sports, in school, or at work because we simply like staying in our comfort zones? This two minute drill is meant to challenge you to think differently. The definition of flow is the mental state of operation in which a person performing an activity is fully immersed in the feeling of energized focus, full involvement, and enjoyment in the process of the activity. Now let's unpack these. Number one, energized focus. This is the result of clarity, knowing who you want to be or what you want to achieve. It's simply knowing your why. But some people may push back saying, I don't know what I want, and that's fine. Keep it simple. It could be a goal as simple as, today I want to challenge myself to respond as a leader when adversity hits. The opposite of energized focus is autopilot. How often do you go into class, practice, or work without any energy or focus? So pick one thing that is going to challenge you today, something that is clear and it gives you your energized focus. Number two, full involvement. This is when you embrace an opportunity with everything you got. You're all in based on your effort and attitude because you know that these are the only two things within your control. Placing your focus on the controllables gives you the confidence to go all in because you know you can't lose when you measure your success by your effort and attitude. This gives you the freedom to get in the flow. The opposite of full involvement is dabbling. It's when you say, well, I guess I'll give it a try when you were challenged. Then you give a half-assed effort. If you dabble, it's probably because you fear giving your best effort and still failing. Your focus is most likely on uncontrollable results instead of your effort and attitude. So embrace being in the present moment and giving everything you got. Third, enjoyment of the process. This is the result of your mindset. You will only enjoy the process when you begin to value getting better more than looking good. When you are training and developing a skill, you know it's gonna be ugly. So sometimes you just gotta laugh at yourself. Now the opposite of enjoying the process is the person that puts unnecessary pressure on themselves to perform by focusing on the uncontrollables. They hate training and they hate practice because they hate making mistakes. They don't understand that making mistakes is how we learn and grow. That's the objective of practice. So go ahead and have some fun and embrace those one-step challenges. It's time for the takeaways for the flow two-minute drill. Number one, seek one-step challenges. Number two, have an energized focus each day. Number three, practice the skill of full involvement. And number four, your mindset will determine how much you enjoy the process. All right, well, that wraps up our two-minute drill. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. And always remember, keep hustling and keep shooting. For more videos like this, or if you have a study that we should check out, hit us up at flowtrainingdevelopment.com.